Hey guys, Proud Cypher here, but you can call me Eric. Today, we're going to be looking at the mainstay of my cybersecurity suite, Malwarebytes Anti-Malware. I've been a long time fan of Malwarebytes, and I was lucky enough to secure a lifetime subscription before they went out of stock. That was years ago, and to this day, they continue to deliver updates for Malwarebytes Premium. But today, I want to look at the software itself, diving deep to explain why Malwarebytes is the best anti-malware solution on the market. There are a lot of contenders, and even Microsoft's own anti-malware suite has become pretty robust, but it's nothing like Malwarebytes. I might be singing its praises a little too eagerly, but let's take a close look at it and see if it really stands up to snuff. First, let's take a look at the free version. The free version of Malwarebytes is pretty strong in its own right. The scan algorithms are the same as in the premium version, and we'll talk about that algorithm in a moment. But first, let's bring up the free version's panel. The primary feature of the free version is its scanning, meaning it'll only catch threats when you run scans. Looking at our first option, Threat Scan, we can see it means business. The main threat scan checks everything on your system drive, checks for any threats running in memory, anything hiding in your on startup programs, anything injected into the system registry, and anything that could be hiding inside of an existing file. The scan's heuristic analysis is second to none. It's so advanced, it's capable of detecting zero-day threats based on their activity, rather than just checking against a database of known threats, though it does that too, just to be sure. This is why I trust this software so much. If you're diligent with it, nothing gets past it. But let's say your issue is a little more deep-seated, better shielded from the software's all-seeing eyes. That's where the custom scan gets involved. Now, it will check for uncommon threat vectors, checking every item in memory to see if something is hiding behind a legitimate program. It'll also run a check on startup and registry objects, just like in the normal scan. Custom scan will also check archive objects like zip and raw files. It will peel apart up to two layers of the archive searching for potential threats. Unfortunately, it can't scan encrypted archives. And this option here is its most powerful asset. Custom scan will check the drive at its most basic level to find root kits. Malware objects that bury themselves more deeply than even the operating system, often found in your boot sector. These little buggers are among the nastiest of malware infections, capable of great destruction and are often utilized in ransomware attacks like WannaCry. If the custom scan can't find anything, Malwarebytes has a separate scan tool for rootkits, and it has not missed a target yet. It's even saved our own Kevin from a serious data breach. I'll include a download link in the description so you can keep it on hand for emergencies. That's pretty much it for the free version, and for most people it will do an admirable job. But if you want the big guns, let's check Malwarebytes Premium. Premium is a veritable fortress of cybersecurity. Now we have real-time protection, which constantly scans the machine for any possible threats using that same heuristic algorithm. However, in real-time mode, it uses very little system resources and is just as capable of catching zero-day threats, even ones it's never seen before. Additionally, the RTP constantly monitors your network traffic for anything unusual. Now, it doesn't transmit any of this data back to Malwarebytes, so anything you're browsing is still safe from prying eyes. What it does do here is block potentially dangerous connections at the IP level, and I've got plenty of examples here showing all the nasties who've been denied access. It's always got my back, even when I'm browsing recklessly, which you shouldn't do. Bad me. Other premium features include scheduled scan, allowing you to schedule any kind of scan in any configuration to happen at any time anywhere from between every few hours, every day, every week, and so on. Now, you can also use Hyperscan, a lightning-fast scan that checks memory and startup objects for immediate threats in case something slips through. Fortunately, that real-time protection catches just about everything. I'm serious, you can't beat this kind of security. But Eric, you say. I'm a budget gamer who has limited system resources. I can't have it eating up CPU cycles when I'm playing competitive game. Well, have I got good news for you, friend, because Malwarebytes has just introduced a play mode, which suppresses notifications and dials back a bit on the program, freeing up more resources. Here, you can set Malwarebytes to engage play mode whenever a certain application is running. Just plug all your games into the list, and it will dial back on resources when you're playing. 
If you have some software that you think Malwarebytes is false flagging, you can set an exception for it here. Single files, entire directories, and even web URLs can be set for Malwarebytes to ignore. Well, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's a little more to the program, but this video covers all of the major points of the software. With years of constant testing and boundary pushing, I can confidently say Malwarebytes Anti-Malware is the best option. Now, I'm not discouraging you from doing your own research because it's important that you do. Find the solution that works best for you. However, I believe Malwarebytes is the top runner. A tight and well-built feature set with legendary detection algorithm and unbeatable real-time protection. I won't be rating the software, but it is getting an official recommendation from Proud Cypher Media. Thank you for watching. Hit that like if you enjoyed the video, remember to share with your friends, and if you want more from us in the future, click the subscribe button, then on the bell icon to make sure you don't miss any future videos.